Alright, hey guys, and um, welcome to more um, Bus Simulator 21 gameplay. Oh, we're doing, of course, we're doing gameplay number three now. But um, I thought we'd just bring you some. I thought we'd do some time bots for you if you want to see the double deck of us. And um, I thought we'd bring you some time bots. I can drive pretty much heavy bus if you fancy fancy doing that. And um, yeah, uh, we can do that. Uh, sand bots. So yeah, and so we'll probably just stay. Uh, I'm pretty much going to go through all this again. You probably know. Uh, but we'll. I think we could always uh, just do another. We can always call it a different name as well. Well, we could call it the same name because it doesn't really matter. So, yes, uh, of course, sandbox mode enabled. Let's accept it. And yeah, we'll just get in yet then. So, I think we'll just. This is a bit more free room, pretty much. So you're not really doing anything, pretty much. Uh, you probably much just free to do, I guess, anything you want in the game, so. Uh, so, yeah, uh, so this, yeah, of course, I think that's what Sandbox mode is. So, uh, yeah, we'll just get through it in the wee moment. We'll practice the Envio 500, we'll get ourselves driving that. I don't know, I'll just think I have a wee, just a wee sort of free one, I guess. You've not got anything really to sort of do, and that's kind of like this on the road, I guess. Uh, you not got any any sort of talking or any stuff like that happening with the, to do with the mission, but we'll be in the missions, eh? Uh, yeah, the character. I think I'll need to put the point of view back up a bit, a bit further down because it's a bit, it's a bit too big. I think the point of view is a bit too. Yeah, I'm going to put the point of view. Uh, point of view is in uh, pretty presence audio. Uh, so uh, where am I going? Is this news interface is quite, I mean, not news interface, this then is it personal preference? That's the one. No, it's not personal preference. It's actually, all oh, it's actually visuals. I bet you're fine. It's getting, mum, I guess, getting, getting a bit. I think I had it about 95. We'll put it up to 90. Let's try that. See, that's all sussed out. Uh, it's still a bit far. I don't know how you can actually get it really close. I, want to, I think this is the fast you can go. The camera maybe goes a bit jet away sometimes when you get up too close. Uh, yeah, yeah, so there's my character. It's always 8, uh, 8 a.m. when I load this game. Like, I'm guessing that's what you do when you're running that. We can always go to night, we can time, time warp it as well. I might time warp this to, to noon. Uh, how do I do that again? Uh, in the menu. Time warp, how do you do that again? I'm trying to think how you time warp it again. Advanced time, there you go. I bet you've had and that's the word we're looking for. Uh, what's it? It's 8 a.m. at the moment. I do that. There we go. Let's do um, let's do sort of late afternoon. Let's do um, let's do 3 a.m. 3 3 a.m. Let's try and see what that is. It's probably a bit better. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so it's a bit better now. So yeah, I, where am I? Is this the depot? I'll need to. I can. This is that so we. This is that so isn't the but we put to your bus, isn't it? Not. Oh, you'll see my character a bit better now. Eh? It's pretty cool, eh? Yeah, you should be in a metal van, This guy, eh? he's he's pretty hardcore. We can yeah, we just walk there. So we walk there. He did a wee jet there. <laughs> Uh, yeah, however, this is actually where you, this is actually where you don't get your bus from. I need to. Bye, bye, bus. <laughs> Have a nice trip. <laughs> I done there. I done something there. There you go. The bus is all yours. I think this is where you sell your bus. Is that the way? Yeah, this is sell your bus. Is there? I think. Yeah, let's say um, we'll. We'll need to move. We'll need to put the money map. We'll need to put the map up. We'll have to task travel to our. To a garage, a dealership, as you say. Uh, where's the dealership? It's somewhere down here. Here we go. There's one here. Yeah. We'll fast travel here uh, to be us to a dealership now, so we're able to practice of us. It's quite good day graphics in this game. I don't know what you guys think on it. I know you got a lot of these American vehicles as well. You've got a step van there as well. It's quite quite cool. It's quite cool the modded by the vehicles, and that's all, guys. We've got a fast person. They got a muscle car there as well. They got an actual charger type thing. They got, a, I'm sure they got a coin Vic as well. I'm sure that's in a coin Vic car. 
Yeah, it's like a muscle car, it's like a charger sort of wicked like thing. Uh, they've got a sewer scene account, there's a Crown Vic in this game as well. You know, sort of the priest cars, you know what I mean? Crown Vics, they were the pretty much the big priest force, every priest force in the States does a lot of the cars. So yeah, we can pretty much do whatever bus we want now, in Bio 200 even as well, another bus that you cut for a laugh. If I think about Bio 200, I think about stagecoach when it comes to this bus pretty much stagecoach. It's always always the every bus, every stay coach bus pretty much. Every bus that stay coach has is an, is an Alexander Dennis project pretty much. Not all the time but mainly it is. It's always a, an Alexander Dennis project. It's the, but when I think about in Bio 200s, I think about stay coach buses. No, uh, that's it. Yeah, that's um, but if you want to see the double decker then this is, this is where everyone wants to go. Everyone wants to just go to the go to the end. We can also try the scanning at the scanny as well. We'll try and get the scanny out for a wee test drive as well. Yeah, I'll give it a scanny for the trucks and that as well. Oh we can try the scanny if you want first, then we can always do the Envio five hundred so yeah. Well let's just try the Envio five hundred because I know everyone wants you want to see this bus, don't you? See we are, this is it. So until you know this bus pretty much, you'll see a lot of these buses in the UK anyway, it's quite a familiar sort of frontage a lot of you as well. Let's have a wee we'll look at it. Trouble Axel as well. And this of course I don't know why they have this massive Axel. They actually have a massive sort of engine a massive sort of area filled up with then um, filled up. I don't know why these guys are just still filling up. They seem to be opening up like that, that's what you're saying. I'm not even near them, I don't know why. Yeah, um, yeah, you don't need to open up. Yeah, you've got a massive thing, uh, it's the sweet bit here, so it actually stays open. So it's a bit annoying. So you've got a massive sort of space here and used up by the engine and that as well. Mm, I don't know why they even use this space, because there's nothing way we've seen all this space being taken. I'm guessing the back door, there's actually a staircase and I'm guessing that's to take, they must have to put the engine on there instead, they must have to maybe re re configure this, com this shaft here I guess to actually can, can talk, sort, of come talk again, sort of contain the engine so they have to put it in there instead, so you're kind of having the engine sort of in a different position. I might be wrong, the engine might be in this spot here, probably here actually. And then maybe use that for like air conditioning stuff at the back there as well. So that's probably what the news is. There's a bit of that going on. I know they have the. I know some of the Hong Kong buses have that sort of bit there. They have their aircon systems in there as well. There's something there. It's good. They need that as well. They need aircon in their country as well. And I guess this is a. We'll get ourselves in the bus as well. This is a quarter spec door as well. It's not an actual. Uh, yeah, it's not really an actual um, scissor doors or fold-in doors, I guess, as you normally know, see. Let's have a look at this interior. Now, this isn't this isn't a British spec, I don't think. Yeah, so this is a more like a German, I guess this is the Berlin spec, I guess. Let's go upstairs, eh? This is what they want to do, this is the double-decker. This is the double-decker, this is the Envio 500 with this interior as well. These buses are built in, in Falkett, Scotland as well. They're bodied up here as well, so I'm quite surprising if you don't know Alexander Dennis, so that's the way. Based in Falkett in Scotland. And they've actually bodied these buses in Falkett in Scotland. So they're not too far. It's not very it's easy easy enough. We've got this as well. The triple, the triple decker. That's what we need. Proper bugger. And they've got the coffee as well. Starbucks, I guess. <laughs> No, that we call it a stab. Still never did have a specific coffee company in this set that we call it in here. Maybe Starbucks or something, or something like that. Something a bit more. Maybe a bit more, I don't know. A bit more, they usually sort of come up and this and The trouble there could be cool to try. You got more adverts, no no directions. So I think I heard this is actually the one direction tribute band. No directions. There are no directions to go to. And you got. What else you got? Jason's Flower Shop, 24 hour shopping, supermarket I guess, see. And of course, uh, yeah, it's a lovely bus, I say. 
I've got a big space here, and yeah, it's a wheelchair access. And I've got a thing that needs to have a goggle for a wheelchair there, I should have that there as well. But this is all pretty accurate, this bus, see. Eh? The only thing, I should actually say about the engines on this bus as well. I mean, they should record, I know they did record them, but I think some of the engine sounds have actually been reused on 18. Uh, I think they have been used for 18. Let's get ourselves in. Uh, and I think we're. There's a horn. Get a car horn. Buses don't really have any sort of specialised horns. That's us. And there's the brake crease. I mean, that's the, the new one things. Test vehicles. Let's go at this tunnel again. Let's look at the bus. We've got the steel axle as well. Proper, proper thing. Um, proper stuffs. Uh, I wanted to stay in the, the white mothers just came back on again surprisingly. I don't know why they've come back on. That's the way... Yeah, I had all this sort of preset for you as well. I presetted all this. Uh, where's the white mother? I don't know if I want them on. The service to be a half a spring and maybe a bit easier. Excuse me. Um, yeah. That should be it now. Resume. There we go. It should be a bit better. Sometimes it makes your game a bit slow. This should have more on the test drive as well. This should have more stuff to look forward to as well. Yeah, this is what gearbox is this is. So I'm trying to figure out what this gearbox is. It's a void for a ZF. It must be a voice box. I'm going to hit the cones. Yeah, it's, it sounds like a voice box. I don't know what. I don't know. I don't know if any of you know. They don't have any. They don't have a list of transmissions. They should have that in the description. What gearbox or transmission that this bus is included as well. And um, because I'm sure in the previous game they had that, so they actually had the gearboxes showing voice got season 18. I'm sure I saw that. So are we getting getting? Yeah, we'll get this bus, see? 680,000. I'm guessing it's dollars or euros, I guess. So it should be dollars because we're, we're in San Francisco. This is a great bus, see? Then we get the interior and this bus is old school as well. There, yeah, you got a Crown Vic there. Yeah, that's the car there I'm talking about. It's a Crown Vic. Is that a Crown Vic there? Yeah, yeah, there's a Crown Vic there. Yeah. Black car. That's a Crown Vic. Yeah, so they're quite modelled and the cars are sort of modelled in real. That's like a Range Rover as well. They're sort of modelled in, that's like a Range Rover, that white one. Um, they're probably kind of modelled in sort of real cars. They were Prius taxi, Priuses, the taxis, the Mustang. Um, they were Toyota Howitz. Um, I don't know what that car's modelled on. I need to wait for the traffic, the traffic's heavier. It's like Russia, I'm pretty much, right, see? We're not, in, we're not in Russia yet. So I'll just put myself out here. I don't know. It's rush hour here, so everyone's everyone's getting home from their work. That might be a dodge, or maybe. It's hard to hear, they're all sort of made up cars, I guess. It's quite good that they actually modelled them quite nicely as well. Um, like Range Rover, actually that's a Range Rover as well. Maybe not, that one's a Range Rover, isn't it? And you've got the, you've got the vintage pickups as well, you've got the vintage step slide as well. You've got the old vintage step slide pickups. Yeah, a bit of indicate on. That makes sense. There we go. That's the that's the that's the ticket. Yeah, the indicator wasn't on. Oh, you got this one as well. Shit, I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm going this way now. I'm driving the fucking bus here as well. Am I getting out here? I got the double decker. So, oh that car. Oh shit, he's driving. He's on the hurry. That guy's on the hurry, and that car. What am I going to do? Just free roam drive, eh? Let's do a bit of free roam and drive, eh? Let's have a wee drive. See what, see if you're going to see anything in this game, eh? There's a kit down there. There's a bit of a kit down going on in this gearbox, eh? I cannot wait. Really, I need to set up a route as well. I'm just driving this pretty much saying this to myself. Well, you can do it on this as well. We'll get some way in, eh? Let's get some way in. Busy road, busy crossing. Oh shit, he's... Yeah, that car went through, right through. I'll just take it easy, guys. Don't, I, don't know why I'm, I don't know why I'm just waiting here. I'm just talking and driving. I'm 
I'm not used to playing this game as well as it's on the road and, and constantly driving on highways and not stopping. Yeah, yeah. Uh, get over the now, that I will get over. Yeah, let's do it. I don't know if they can stop here and get the bus. Uh, should I do that? We're well, not ruling ourselves, see. Oh, are we? No, I think we're out of service. Yeah, we're out of service. Yeah, I need to set our route up for you and then we can drive this bus. So we'll have a look at the insidia. Whoa, things on that there, car there. They actually have physics in the cars as well, like you don't go through them like on the road, you use the cars, that's the way. Act like you actually go through them and this that's who has, like, like they, have, they have like invisible walls, but on this they actually have actual physics, actually hitting you as well, so it's handy. Let's take, let's go in until uh, the AI takes over. That's a cool way. It's a cool bus, this is the Envial 500, so the pretty much bigger than the 400. I think this is actually, it's, it's like the, MN, the MMC, the actual MMC body as well, like the actual frontage is an Envial 400 sort of frontage. Uh, where am I going? I don't know where I'm driving. This free one drive. Let's have a look at the map. We'll just drive wherever we feel on our own pressure, if you don't mind. I'll show you some of this map. Yeah, uh, we'll just drive. We've got some pop-ins and that. I'm guessing it's better than on the road. You've not got like ma ma minor popping, and I mean you've not got like major popping. Remember, I remember there's a, a game I've worked on on YouTube. It was called London Taxi Challenge or something. I don't know how bad, bad the pop up was in that game. It's like funny. It's like it was on the week. It was actually released on PS2 as well, and the draw distance as that was like really bad. Right, it was probably one of the last games I've seen pretty much, hey, it's a shit game. Uh, but yeah, we won't really say much of it on that game, but it's, it's, it's um, pretty much you driving in London on a taxi. This is the highway we're on, eh? We're on, I don't know what we're on, I-65 or something, or I-64, I don't know. This is one of these inner states. And, 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 and what do you call it, inner states, so I'm going past 53 mile an hour. I don't even realise the speed of this thing is. Whoa. This is that side of this is I'm confused with the controls. Oh, he's the he's the town now. Yeah, I must have this, I need to try now. It has the news has break in as well. I can't I don't have any people on the bus. That's the problem. That'll be that'll be a bit of a hassle driving too fast. You don't want to brake too hard, harshly I guess, and buses are yeah, to be they're meant to be generally, I'm guessing they're meant to be controlled generally. See crossing over? That's fine. I should have waited because this is a, that was actually a crosswalk as well, so they stopped. We'll just have a look, let's have a look in third person eh? Let's look at a red bus there, eh? a big red bus we've got. We've got a big, was that a big waterfall there or something I saw? No it's not, I thought I saw a waterfall. No it's not, it's the, it's a nice wee, it's a nice wee end. Um, it's a nice wee, um, what do you call it? And this is a nice wee, um, I don't know what you say, and um, just a wee nice harbour, I guess. Very really nice here. Just take that time, eh? Yeah, it's cool actually, that, eh? Having something, it, it sort of has a good immersion as well. It's not like, it's not like they did this game and they made a bit of effort to this game. I do like the landscape. I don't know why Max, I've not seen the whole game, the whole map as well. I've not only seen like some of the map. This must be a voice gearbox in this bus. It's something like a voice box. And just if any of you want to comment below, if you have a bit more if you're bus fan fan fanatics can you can probably leave my comment below. Because I'm sure this sounds like a voice gearbox. Just by the sound of the long gear changes, it's got a bit of a cast kick down and then it might be an Alison box as well, could they a bit of a hash kit down. There's actually water effects as well, isn't there? Is there? Oh yeah, it's cool, puddle effects. Are oh, you driving heavy rain as well? Proper thing, eh? We need to get the rain and get rain effects as well. That's another thing. It's not rain at the moment. So, yeah. I don't know what I'd call this one double decker driving or something. Sandbox mode, obviously, because this is sandbox one, so it's not really kind of official game. We're not doing the, the campaign. 
I need to get this first set, set up a service. This is the set of service, so I'm just driving without any service, obviously. So, obviously, I won't be able to pay any people and stuff until I set a service up. But, uh, yeah, I think maybe this is one of the words. You should have a bit of metal heads, you should have like thrash metal heads. This is the Bay Area as well, we need some thrashers and stuff like that going around. I mean, you can get hardcore guys, I might, I might of course they see my, my, um, my NPC looks like a hardcore guy. He's, he just doesn't look like he'd be driving us, it's like he just stole this bus that he might say, you think about it. I don't know if this camera can get out close. Yeah, it's a bit strange, the camera. Yeah, he looks like he's, yeah, he looks like he keep us in a bit of hardcore skateboard as well. He's a bit of a skater guy as well. I picture him as that. He's obviously made up, but he could be playing, playing a bit of, um, yeah, as murder and skateboarding and he's free time. But he's obviously driving a bus at his own job. Oh, the car he pulls out in front of me as well. That's quite cool. Oh shit, I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, I better pull out. It's quite cool, the traffic is pretty good, they can actually, you park the bus up, they can actually get, they can actually make the effort pulling, getting in front of you as well. I'm sure that happens. I'll need to try and fill a wee space to pull in. I'll just pull in the middle of the road somewhere and just park the bus up. Um, they actually don't stop, they actually pull. It's quite cool actually. I'm guessing that's like real life as well. There's a coin back there. The only thing I don't like, I dislike it, is the traffic. It looks like it's on a scale electric track as well. You can see the way the steer as well. I don't know if you've noticed that, but I'm something and they should get on is to fix the steer, because you can see the they're actually connected to a scale electric track. The traffic look, it's really steering like it's on a scale electric track. I'll go through for a person. It's a bit easier. See this, like that goes. It's kind of, maybe it just depends, so that's the tunnel system when there's, there's a hotel, a motel up there isn't it? Yeah, it's quite cool, I'm keeping people back. Just doing some sightseeing eh? Let's do some sightseeing. This will be the sightseeing by the way, call it that. Sightseeing with a double decker bus. Because all my dad double decker buses anyway, we've just cut off the sight end to his buses, sightseeing buses. If you don't know that. That's how they do it. They use like old buses, second hand buses, but they they actually cut off the roofs off the off the old buses and I don't know if this is the way we came on earlier. I'm getting mixed up, here we are. This looks like we faced we were here earlier. Oh yeah, it's downtown up there. We're getting a bit American, I'm trying to pick up some American phases I guess, because when we're, we're in San Francisco so we just see downtown. It's downtown and um, Depot, a garage, garage. I think that's how you say it in the states. I'm not good at pronunciation. Got some American, probably. I'm guessing they got some American sort of in um, voiceovers as well. I'm guessing they just hired a few American people to take over and do American voiceovers. It's very cool. I know this is a German developed game, but it's surprising that they can actually take over. It's quite good that they can actually take over. Well, taking a bit of a Oh shit, I assume we need to reverse this bus, it's not the right thing to do. I mean, but you can never, you can never reverse the bus on, on your route. Oh shit, there's a car just went in front of me, I didn't check my mirrors. You must have just drove right pulled out of me. Let's go, let's go to the transit terminal, let's do it. Oh shit, 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 I'm not going to get into the turn. Steam is actually pretty bad. You'd never need to reverse the bus in real life. Shit, I don't know how I'm doing this. This is bad, this is, this is the worst thing you do in a bus driver. Pretty much turning your bus and have to wait for us on, on, on the, inter in the, in the intersection. I'm going to be having pretty American, I'm trying to see a lot of American. This is the transit terminal. So if you want to pack your, this is like the, this is like the bus terminal, your bus station or whatever you call it, your main transit terminal. You got all, all the buses. They should use a bit, make a bit more effort as well. I've seen some comment on this as well. Oh, the bus just appeared there. Is that just me? Something just happened to the bus. Let me see again. No, it must have been me. No, it's the stats. Better pardon. I thought the bus literally disappeared for a sec when I went through that wall. 
Oh, it does if you're clear credit. The bus actually just slips back and disappears like V and then it comes back. Yeah, they need to try and make a bit more effort at the transit tower because this should use a bit more. This is the bus stop there. I think I think on the pictures there was actually like buses in the bottom there, and it's only like one stop there and one stop there. An opposite side, right one there. So only needs like two spaces. That's it's just a bit despair. I mean, this should this should be a bit more effort because I mean, actually the video was until it was a bit until it was mistaken that they actually showed buses in in the thumbnails. There was actually buses in the actual terminal two buses together and there's only like one bus stop here there was two stops and two one of the petrol stream shots was two buses together not two on the same way one bus there and one bus of course one bus in that space the empty space of course that's what i mean same very the only bus stop here there's just have a bus stop there as well and it's just they should do that yeah, because of the console, this is also PS4, also PS4, they can only reset it on maybe limitations, I guess. So something that's gone, also PS4 is getting to its thing right now, there's lots of limitations down on PS4, they can't really up, um, fit as much now these days. Yeah, so there's the transit terminal, it's very really cool actually. It looks very modern and spacious, waiting. Yeah, it's good for a person again. This is the one back here. Eh? Run down. Yeah, they should make a bit more effort down there as well. There's no bus stops there, no bus stops there. Just bus stop there and bus stop there. Two bus stops going either side. One, one, one there and one going out that way. That's it, I guess. No bus stop in the centre. I don't know why they made these bay buys. You just drive right through them, but I don't know. Maybe that's just maybe they're going to do that eventually. I don't know why they took them all out. But yeah, I'll just have to see. But I don't know if I'll dive for through the whole map. I'll try and find some other areas that we should see as well. Uh, we'll quickly go through some other areas. I probably won't make it too long the video. I'll yeah, just make it make it just decent enough so you guys can see it green light. We are we we're in the northern part here. Eh? Let me look at my mini map. So we want to try and get myself in. Where am I going? This is been that way. My bad. I'm glad I didn't need to reverse there. So I think I'm thinking the videos that I did actually was videos are a bit echoey by the way if you're wondering the voiceovers just uh, I can't really do anything about that either. So if you're wondering about the videos echoing the reverbing from there's a bit we there's a bit of echoing from the from the actual microphone and that as well, so just Excuse that. I can't really do anything about it. I wish I don't have any microphone and this phrase directly from the telly, that's it. I'm gonna to have to have a wee quick look at the map again. Uh, where am I going? I don't know. Uh what's why we just went this way. When you go back on the highway again. When you go to Code Island, do you? I don't know if there's that's a waypoint you can stick a waypoint in or something. We can fast travel. It's over here at the driveway. Uh, we can also go here in, in these places. Sea view, sea, sea view, valley's fine. Oaklands. Let's have a look at uh, Gold Island. Let's fast travel to go at Gold Island. I'm sure it's going to take me on my bus. I'm guessing the bus is still going to respawn here, I guess. I'll just point me down. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, this is in. Uh, my bus started up, it sounds like I heard my bus starting and I don't know if the engine. I don't know. My bus started, it sounds like it just set up, yeah. Yeah, I don't know if they need to improve the sounds on the bus as well. I think there's something wrong with the bus sounds. No, I'm sure they're fine. It's just me, it sounds like, it sounds like a bus, doesn't it? Oh, this is the oh shit! Whoa, the bus like we just stepped over there. I just hit the hit the tree there. Shit, that damaged my bus there. But the bus like we just <laughs> almost tipped itself over there. Physics, I guess there's a bit of physics. I must have hit a tree. I must have hit that tree there. This is the bit now. This little day. I want to. Yeah, this is a single road. This is the sort of the beaten track a little bit. Eh? It's actually good that so they make different roadways. Yeah, it's a bit 
Yeah, this is good I would do. Oh, is this? Don't tell me I've went the wrong way here. Shit, have I went the wrong here? Shit, I think I have. It's not really pointing out any signs. Oh yeah, I'm dying the wrong way. Shit. <laughs> Damn it. That's it. Where am I going? Do we rest and let the way right through? It should have been pointing out with a no entry sign. There should have been a no entry sign there so we can see it. That's a bit, that's, that's a bit just... They need to put a no entry sign there. That's the thing, there's no entry to the road there. There isn't a sign there to tell me that I'm going the wrong way. That's it, that's something they need to put in. There's no sign there, so that's something they need to add in it. So, yeah, so tell me if you're watching this video, please. There's some things that need to be investigated in this game a bit as well, bugs. Can you not even get yourself on the highway there then? You must not then. So we're pretty much stuck on Gold Island then. Until I don't even know. This is right now. It's traffic. There's cars coming that way as well. Oh, here we go. There's the highway. Uh, what's this side? Is this what? What one? What's this name of the sign? This sign. Oh, here we are. This is the right way. So this is three three nine. Well, it should be I three three nine or something. Here we are. We're coming on the 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 end. The end is we're coming on the interchange. You call it. Is it interchange? I keep getting what you call them in America. I don't know what you call them. Yeah, I don't know what you call them. What you call them, that, eh? Let's say, and have a look at external. So, yeah, I don't think they indicate one. So, I'm just doing a bit of sightseeing here, so, just then, just the screws and the thing is, I need to use the indicator. Have I got my indicator on? I have got my indicator on, eh? My indicator didn't cancel. That's why it's just beeping like that. Yeah. Oh, is this just going to fit under here? Oh, it's so close. No, it should fit under here because this is why I've got it. Eh? The double decker. They wouldn't have the, they wouldn't have the, have the best one on this bit. The little bridge. Yeah, I'm doing a bit. Been a bit. I'm not being too bad driving. I think you have enjoyed my driving. We're going back and go die one again, I've just done a... I think we're on the main landing. I'm doing a bit of kit down now. Yeah. It must be a ZF or a boy bot really in this bus, eh? Just tell me. Maybe it's, a, maybe it's an Allison. It must be an Allison because it kits down when you... slow down. You kit down. I'm going about 25,000. I must be in its field. I must be on top of you now, eh? I've got to be. So I have one is, this is limited to 50 mile an hour, I think, in this country, I think, yeah. But I'm doing over that speed. I've got this speed to up, haven't I? Yeah, that should help. So you get me up to 50, I guess. Or maybe it's 70. Oh, this is not I'm going fast, eh? I'm gonna, gonna get to, I'm gonna hit the limit anyway. Oh shit, there's a thing we hear. It doesn't tell me about this, eh? Why is it telling me this? Yeah, they need to set this game a wee bit, eh? Yeah, I'm going to find somewhere at, so I think we'll probably finish this one off, I think. But I've done a bit of free roaming here, eh? Free roam driving. I wonder how the AI driver would take over this bus. I don't know how I'm going to manage that. They didn't have this. Tell me this was blocked. I don't know. I'm going to take, I'm going to get the AI to take over, see how they can manage getting through the invisible wall without me. Shouldn't be doing this on the highway, but I think we'll maybe just finish it off, eh? Press it respawns, it respawns myself. Yeah, so that's the Envio 500 there for you there, so yeah, we'll show you a bit of it. So we're out of server, so I'm guessing we're not on server, so obviously. We're just driving this, not on, not on private way, obviously. So there's triple that so, uh, so yeah, it's like kind of a 6x2 kind of like a truck slash here, we've it, obviously. I think the AI will take over shortly, I guess, and just spawns in, I guess, the driver. Uh, so yeah, so he goes to the Scottish bottle buses as well, body the body, body them for these buses, so there's a lot of um, Scottish heritage, of course, as you see, proper.
Brett's belt. And yeah, I mean, surprisingly enough, um, I could have said this that's way, but my uncle actually needs to build, working, needs to build um, buses for Alexander Dennis. Obviously, I went for, for, for a very long time, and she built um, in Vio 200s. I think he built 400s as well, but until he was building the old Wayland before Alexander, before they were pre Alexander Dennis, but obviously under. I think underwater, Alexander, I guess, but in the days when they were building the Olympians. Uh, there we go, that's the driver in the bus, I think, now. It will be. There we go, he's going to be driving on his way. Hopefully he'll get through the invisible wall. Yeah, he's ready to rock and roll. <laughs> I have to see how this goes the fan. Yeah, he's away. Oh, shit, he can't get through the wall, really. Can he not even drive through that? Like the cars can drive through the invisible wall and, the, and why the bus? He's in the AI bus now, so... Why is, why is that it's happening? It's just pushing it pretty much, it's like your trucks in the way. Maybe your trucks in the way have been... Like this, say... So he can't drive through the wall then? Can I get through him then? Can you not reverse? He can't reverse, so he's just very much um, driving blind. We'll just walk our way back and then we'll still leave it, still even to it. Sorry, Jack, sorry about that. But, yeah, I don't know if the bus will respawn itself when I go a distance away. I think it disappears actually when I'm going to get one over. Careful. What's this building up now, the traffic? It's my bus that's doing all this for them. That's the problem. Um, the NPCs, this is a grand fair fault a little bit as well. Yeah, the bus is away, the bus is away now. It's despawned itself. I'm guessing it despawns itself and then obviously spawns itself, spawns somewhere else now. I'm guessing it's respawned itself somewhere else. But, uh, yeah, I think we'll probably finish this one off. I would like someone for grand fair fault. Oh, I said this, this does take it, this does have grand fair fault vibes to it. Definitely this game as well. Someone said in the comments as well, it's a bit of a GTA feel to it. I like one and I could one that, I could have it a gun on me and that. It feels like I'm one one on one on the highway, going to rob a car. Pretty much. This this is GTA this is a bit of GTA GTA game feel to it. I'm going to can one and I can one and one away from the free saw, so one and away pick up a car. And let's do the taxi. <laughs> no, you can't do it. Uh, there's nothing, there's no way. Yeah, the bus is gone. And it's probably respawned itself now because it's brought the road. I'm guessing I went far away from it, so I don't know where it's gone now. But, but yeah, I think we'll probably finish this one off now. Let's just stay by myself here then on the highway. Uh, so, yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, this video of Sam Bots Mode, the double decker. Uh, so, yeah, just a wee quick video there for you. you know. Well, I mean, it's been a bit of a quick map away and let's talking about the bus and that a wee bit but yeah uh, it's, but it's been good that's the way uh, I hope you have been enjoying that I'm going to hopefully cover a bit more bus um, 21 so there's more videos coming up soon yeah uh, so I mean yeah I had cool guys um, just with me cool as well yeah he just he's got his man bun on his beanie as well so he does have the one here if you want to ask he's a he's a metal head he doesn't have a band shirt, on. he's just wearing a blank shirt on, obviously. He's got a metal band shirt somewhere, which he just hasn't got it on today, so this is the way we'll get... We'll go. He's got his Vans shirt on, his Vans, Vans shirt, and T-shirt is obviously just wearing a blank and pull a blank and T-shirt on. And so, yeah. So, yes. So, yeah. He's got the long hair, he's got a band, he's got a man bun under the beanie, so, yes. He's a metal head. He's not got piercings, so don't get me wrong, piercings aren't available, so yeah, and yeah, so yeah. So, yeah, so thank you very much then for watching this video. Uh, we're pretty much just sitting on the highway here, probably just the bus has left us up behind now. The AI driver's took over, he's got stuck, he's respawned somewhere. But yeah, I'm going to hopefully get back. I might do a bit more sandbox mode as well, some battle videos, but we'll just have it. It was a nice, have a wee quick drive with the double decker there. So thank you again for watching. Make sure to like this video, make sure to comment below, make sure to sub to my channel. I'll have my 
On the roads, pre West, gigs pre West, on the road pre West, bus 721 pre West as well. Check out those if you like a bit of truck simulator, truck simulation on the roads as for you. I like some gigs. If you like some gigs and that, you can check out that as well. And yeah, uh, I shall see you again in the next video. So, so bye for now.